And the last poem is actually a new story. This is, uh, um, these are older poems, and this is uh, the best oldie of the top 40, okay? <laughs> a new story. Several years ago, reverts back to the VA hospital experience. Actually, I was in numbers of, uh, I'm a recovered alcoholic and other past lives. And I've been sober for the past 19 years. So this is a new story, truly. Several years ago, I was a patient at the VA hospital in Fort Lyons, Colorado. I got a message to call this woman, so I called her up. She said to me, I'm looking for an Indian. Are you an Indian? Yes, I said. Oh good, she said. I'll explain why I'm looking for an Indian. And she explained. Every year we put on a parade in town. A Frontier Day parade. It's exciting and important. But we have, and we have a lot of participation. Yes, I said. Well, she said, our theme is Frontier and we try to do it well. In the past, we used to make up paper mache Indians, but that was years ago. Yes, I said. And then more recently, we had some people who dressed up as Indians to make it more authentic, you understand. Real people. Yes, I said. Well, she said, that didn't seem right, but we had a problem. There was a lack of Indians. Yes, I said. <laughs> this year we wanted to do it right. We have looked hard and high but Indians for Indians, but there didn't seem to be any in this part of Colorado. Yes, I said. We want to make it real, you understand. Put a real Indian on a float, not just a paper mache dummy or an Anglo dressed as an Indian but a real Indian with feathers and paint, maybe even a medicine man. Yes, I said. And then we learned the VA hospital had an Indian here. We were so happy, she said, happily. Yes, I said, there are several of us here. Oh, good, she said. Well, the next spring, I got another message at the college where I worked. I called the woman. She was so happy that I returned her call. And then she explained that Sir Francis Drake, the English pirate, she didn't say that, I did, was going to land on the coast of California in June again. And then she said she was looking for Indians. No, I said, no. <laughs> Thank you. And that's, and that's when I began to write from Sand Creek, <laughs> or shortly around that time. Thank you.